going on everybody? Welcome back to episode number two of our Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. I know, again, this is a bit of an offshoot for the channel, but I thought I'd try something just a little different uh, for a bit of a day off kind of stream. Now, uh, over the break, I did go ahead and train up just a couple of uh, levels for each Pokemon in the hopes that I would get some like stab moves on each of them. Uh, obviously, and I'll, I'll start with our actual starter here, Ace. Our big, awesome Kabutops, rock and water type, uh, has battle armor, so it can block those critical hits. I did get him up to 11, uh, but he did not learn any new moves, uh, so he still has Scratch and Absorb as, as the main damaging moves here. Harden and Leer, probably not going to be quite so uh, important. Uh, Max Arminum uh, did level up to level 9, again, in the hopes of trying to get like a Thundershock or something along those lines. We never got there. Instead, uh, we're still stuck with Growl and Thunder Wave does absolutely no damage this Pokemon, so hopefully, uh, you know, as we as we maybe get through this episode or future episodes, we can level this guy up uh, and hopefully get him to where he needs to be. And then finally, Outlaw, after Outlaw Pete, our Corsola, leveled up to level 9 as well. Unfortunately, the only move learned here is Harden, not very exciting for a Nuzlocke, but uh, Tackle actually does a good bit, and, and Outlaw's pretty beefy. I'm not gonna lie, Outlaw's pretty awesome. So, uh, in training, I found that uh, Outlaw was actually doing the most. So, uh, we will see. I think what I will do uh, very quickly, actually, you know what, let's start off with our Viridian Forest Encounter. Uh, we're gonna start there, just see what we can get. Uh, and then probably uh, go ahead and jump into our big battle uh, with our rival Will, who hopefully we can beat. Uh, unfortunately, that uh, that Breloom is going to be a problem for us. We got to find a way to uh, kind of get around that. We do have Thunder Wave on uh, Max here, so I'm hoping that we can kind of get that one off. That's why I'm putting Max out front uh, as well, so we can. Thunder Wave, whatever Pokemon comes our way. There are actually a couple of items here in Viridian Forest, so I think we're gonna start by picking those up, uh, and hopefully, hopefully, we can find something really, really helpful for the team. If we do get something for the team, the goal will uh, probably be to take a peek at, you know, what we've got, what we need, and then, uh, ooh, a rare candy. Well, that's a very good item. Uh, it's no Master Ball, but it's a good item. All right, let's see what we get here. A Natu. Uh, Natu isn't bad, actually. Um, I really like Zatu a, a lot, uh, in fact. So let's go ahead, let's Thunder Wave this, and then we'll move over to, well, I don't know, can we actually even deal damage to this thing? Uh, unfortunately, Synchronize on Max does mean that we, uh, we get hit. Uh, or Synchronize on the Natu, excuse me. Uh, alright, let's, uh, I'm a little worried that this is just gonna kill. Okay, if we go to Ace and Absorb, uh, we should be okay, because that's not going to do a lot of damage here. Uh, but that paralyzed uh, status ailment, hopefully going to help us catch this Natu here. Like I said, Natu's actually a pretty good one, especially if we can get like a, uh, a Gust or something along those lines. That's really going to help out a lot against this Breloom. It's kind of exactly what we needed, uh, to be honest. Kind of like that. Uh, really like that, in fact. So, let's see what we can get here. Really, really stoked for this Nuzlocke. I know, like I said at the at the top of the episode, I know this is a little bit different than our normal content. Obviously, we're very heavily rooted in magic, but we do play other games, uh, and so recording a series that is not necessarily magic related is just kind of a fun little way to to take a step back and enjoy some other content and do some fun stuff there. So we'll do one more absorb, heal back up here. Hopefully, we don't get much damage. That's perfect. Look at this. This is just such a great start to the episode. Ooh, and it already has Peck. That's perfect. You are going to want to level this thing up uh, before, I think, going into the battle with with our rival. I think what we might, we might kind of reverse order this a little bit. We'll, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, and got it on the first try. Heck, yes. What a great start. All right. Natu's data added to the Pokedex. I love it. Do we want to give a nickname to Natu? We do, uh, and I think what we're gonna name Natu is Omega, uh, for Omega who hangs out in chat all the time. Absolutely appreciate you hanging out with us, uh, and let's let's go ahead and do this. Let's see what item, if any, uh, Natu is holding as well. Looks like it's not. That's fine. Uh, and let's go ahead, just while we're here, let's switch out Max for Ace. There is one more item at the start of the forest that I would like to pick up very quickly, uh, and then that way we've got a nice little rounded start. We may even use that rare candy 
uh, as we're leveling up Natu just to help us out a little bit here uh, and make sure that we're heading in the right direction. Shoal Shell. I don't actually remember what Shoal Shell does. Let's, let's go check that out really quick. Uh, we can also sell that X feed that we got. Pretty uh, striped in blue and white. Okay. Not important. Uh, oh, okay. Well, let's see what else we could have found here. I will say, ooh, Elkid. I do really like Elkid. Thankfully, we do have Max already, uh, so we really don't need another electric type. Uh, but I will say, uh, if I could have chosen between Elkid and a Minum, I definitely would have taken the Elkid every day of the week. Uh, but that's okay. Let's go ahead. Let's run to. Uh, let's. Let's do a little bit of quick switch training, I think. Uh, what I did find in this grass here uh, is that there are x Plowed in here, uh, which is obviously really, really good uh, for training. And there we go. Look at that. Uh, very, very good for training. We can go ahead, kill this thing, and get just a ton of experience. It's over 100 uh, for one Pokemon. Now, what do we want to train? I think, honestly, we need to train Outlaw up a little bit here. Uh, Outlaw really needs to get a stab, just water move, uh, and so if we can uh, tackle this thing to death, hopefully we can get something pretty quickly here. Very close to level 10 as well, so maybe we can get there with this, uh, or at least get close. That's all we need, right? Uh, guys, let me know your thoughts on this series as we're over here just training up a little bit for, for uh, the time being. I just, I'd really like to gauge the interest in this kind of series again, uh, being that it is so different from our norm. Uh, I don't want to like push it resolves in the direction of uh, getting away from magic content. That's certainly not the goal by any means. Uh, it's just the simple fact that uh, while magic content is fun, we obviously have other games that we want to play. Uh, and so throwing up something a little bit different onto the channel is kind of a nice way to do that. Ooh, a lady in here. That's a cool one. I have actually not seen the lady in here. Uh, does it have... Uh, I doubt it. Pursuit would be the only thing I'd worry about. I don't actually know if Lady even knows Pursuit, I'll be honest. Um, Alright. Uh, I'm just switching out to Ace here because Ace is kind of an easy way to, to just hasten up the process, we will say. <laughs> uh, probably could have gone out to Outlaw, but that's okay. Let's get Omega up just a little bit. Level 5, that's not bad. Um, the Like I said, so there is a level modifier on trainers, uh, and so I'm a little worried that we're actually going to run into an issue of like just a really strong rival battle. We might lose some Pokemon uh, early on in this one. Uh, and I'm very, very sad to say that that's the risk. So I do want to make sure Omega, I'm going to go ahead and level or uh, uh, heal Omega up a little bit here. But I am a little worried because there's there's a very real chance that we might just get wrecked by uh, Will here. So <laughs> let's see what we can do. Uh, rivals do carry their starter throughout the game. I uh, did make sure to tick that box. So uh, Breloom will still be in the party here. Uh, and unfortunately, we may just end up having to train a good bit uh, before we can really take on the rival battle. I'm just so worried about that. Uh, let's check out uh, Omega really quickly. Let's see the, the move set on this little guy. Peck and Leer. Pretty straightforward. Um, I know the correct thing is to wait on the rare candy. So I think what we're going to do, just fight a couple more things. We're not going to go too crazy because I don't want to waste the entire episode just training up. But... If we can get Omega to a point where it's usable in battle, uh, level-wise, then we will be to a really, really nice point. We can hopefully take on that rival battle with some confidence, uh, and we'll rare candy uh, as well. So we will make sure that, you know, after we've trained up a little bit, we'll rare candy him uh, and get him to where he needs to be. I'm really leaning on Omega here for this one, and uh, Ace, to be honest. Outlaw's very strong, very bulky. Um, which is great, but just doesn't have any good moves. Uh, there's no way around it. It just has no really great moves. We're gonna swap out to Ace here. Uh, again, trying to speed up that process a little bit. I could uh, technically use the speed up button, but I'm gonna avoid it. Uh, nobody likes that speed up button. It makes it sound terrible as well because the music speeds up like crazy. Uh, it's bad, really bad. <laughs> Uh, but we will actually get Ace up to level 12, I think, here, which is good. That's helpful. I don't know what moves. I feel like probably very little uh, does Ace actually learn. Um, 
in the early, you know, levels of the game. Uh, so I am a little worried here that our our team as a whole just isn't going to necessarily learn a whole lot of great moves. Um, Minum is kind of a worry for me as well. Uh, just because Minum, you know, not exactly the star electric type in my mind. Don't get me wrong, Max. I love you, but just a little worried about that as we go through. Here we go, getting that kill on the Swalot. Uh, Omega getting a little experience. Ace getting up to level 12. Do we get a new move? Don't think so. Didn't think so. All right. Uh, let's get just, like I said, just a level or two more, and then we will rare candy up on Omega. Get it where it needs to be. Uh, I'm going to swap out, though, to Outlaw this time. So we do need to get Outlaw leveled up, and again, hopefully get that stab move. Just so worried, so worried that we might run into an issue with this rival battle. I don't want to lose any Pokemon, but we do, we do. There's nothing we can do about it. We got to do the best we can. Thankfully, that Poison Gas missing twice. Uh, all of these Swalots, by the way, have the that Citrus Berry, which is like a really good berry to have, not going to lie. Uh, would love to have one, but we didn't get a Swalot, so no worries there. Uh, Thief would be tough in this move. Um, Sludge. Okay. Let's not get poisoned. Let's avoid poison. Alright, cool. Let's do it. Nope. Nope, nope. Don't poison me. Don't do it. Don't you dare. Okay. <laughs> Alright, getting the kill on that Swalot. Uh, Omega, can we level you up? No, not quite yet. Oh no, one more. One more. One more Pokemon, I think, and we'll, we'll get another level. And then we'll probably just go ahead and rare candy. Uh, oh, guys, I'm so stressed. I'm so worried. Like, what if we just die? Uh, I'm gonna straight run from Torkoal. Torkoal's one of those that we really don't... Until Outlaw knows a stab move, or Ace, but really I'd like Outlaw to be the, our main water type if we can help it. Uh, just because water tends to be more special focused, and so I want to make sure that we can get those early, uh, you know, water guns, bubbles, things like that. I want to get that on Outlaw, so that way we've got, uh, that stab water type move if we need it. Yawn coming through, looks like this is going to be a fun one. Such a fun one. Um, let me know down below if in these situations, and this was actually just poor planning on my part. Wow. And the poison gas. Wow. Uh, well, that's terrible for us. Uh, we may just swap out the ace here. We'll just... I know it's taking experience away a little bit. Uh, let me know, though, if you guys are okay with using the speed up button, at least in situations like this. I just don't want the music in particular to be, like, god-awful, uh, which is absolutely the case when you use the speed up button. Um, and so I just don't want that to be the case. Citrus Fairy healing up here this Swalot, but then we just scratch it a couple times for the win. Um... I am really, like I said, just stoked about this. Ooh, that crit. That crit. Yes. That's what we wanted. Omega, get us a level. There we go. There we go. There we go. Outlaw, get into level 10. Look at this. Look at this. Still no move, though. <laughs> uh, okay, a little worried about Outlaw, being that Outlaw is poisoned here. So we're going to move a little bit. And we're going to take a quick peek. Outlaw. Oh, no. Excuse me. It has natural cure. Thank you, Outlaw, for being just the best kind of Pokemon. <laughs> uh, Alright. Let's go heal up, and then I think... Do we take on the rival? We're like 15 minutes in, and all we've done is catch Omega. Which, Omega, don't get me wrong, you're a great asset to the party here, but a little worried. <laughs> um, Alright, let's see. We got this. All right, no worries at all, right? We can totally do this. Let's let's throw candy up. Omega, you need it. We need you to have. I'm so ashamed because if Omega just straight dies, this is gonna be terrible. Um. All right, so if we swap to Max first, first, then theoretically, uh, we can paralyze the Pokemon that we are up against first, and then hopefully kind of get the win, but. I'm so worried because I do feel like we're very underleveled. That's that's the kind of nail-biting content you guys want, right? I believe he has two Pokemon, so Breloom and an Unknown, I believe, is what we're up against here. You probably don't even have any badges yet. Uh, Garm won't let you through without them. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Let's find out. Will, let's find out. Oh, I'm so stressed. Kabutops, what? It has a... Will has a Kabutops? Why? Why? Uh, Thunder Wave it. 
Let's go. Um, okay, so if we Thunder Wave and then we swap to our Ace, then theoretically we should be okay. Um, <laughs> I'm so nervous. Oh, I'm so nervous. Okay, we're taking a huge risk because we know what the moveset is, right? Like, if it just has Absorb, we're just screwed. Um, or if it uses Absorb. Okay, Defense fell. That's scary. Let's Absorb it. And we have to hope for that Paralyze. Please Paralyze. The good news is we are faster. It used Harden. Why did it use Harden? Why? I mean, the computer is not smart. Okay. Absorb. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. I'm feeling okay about this first one now. Uh, it's the Breloom now that I am very worried about. Paralyzed and can't move. You're darn right. Alright. One more Absorb. Let's finish this one off. Ooh, okay. Okay. We did it. We did it. We did it. We got one Pokemon down. Max getting all that experience. Ace getting all that experience. Breloom. Now here is the worry. Max. We're doing the same thing. We're doing the same trick again, and hopefully, hopefully, this works. Thank goodness, Max, you are so quick. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Okay, Freyloom's paralyzed. Fantastic. Uh, let's swap out. Ugh, Omega's level 7. Do we do it? I don't think we can. Okay, but what we can do, hold on, we can just growl a little bit. Now I know this is a, this is this is not a super exciting one, but what we're doing is minimizing the attack damage. Ooh, that's scary. The attack damage that this thing can output for us, uh, and then hopefully stuns for it. Okay, okay. I mean that sucks, but it's not the end of the world. We're gonna try and get one more growl off. Perfect. We still outspeed, obviously. That's great. That attack is falling. Do we try for one more? I think we have to. We have to. We can't. We cannot risk this. Like, Omega is too crucial for the team. It's leech seeding. That's scary. Uh, it's not gotten paralyzed yet, has it? Okay, but that's fine. Now we get to swap out. Now we get to swap out. It's got four, minus four on the attack here, so theoretically. Not gonna do that much damage. Okay, that wasn't terrible. Heck it, let's go. Ooh, yes, yes. All right. We have to hope we don't get paralyzed. Um, this is a very nail-biting kind of battle. Um, okay, tackle it again. All right, that's fine. Perfect, all right. Here's the risk, here's the risk. If we get paralyzed, we ha Oh! Oh! Thank you, Omega, and thank you, Max. Oh my gosh, what what a tag team. Max, can you learn? Oh, thank you, you learned an attack. Oh, finally. Um, okay, I think we're actually going to stop then here soon. We're going to go heal up, and then we're going to pause the episode. We're going to keep these at, like, 20 minutes, I think. 20 minutes seems like a good amount of time. That gives us, it gives us a nice little break. Um, all right, we did it. We beat Will, we didn't lose a single Mon. I am impressed. I am so impressed, that's amazing. All right, uh, I really thought Omega was at risk being how low it was, but I think those growls came in clutch. I'm so glad we did that. I mean, if you think about it, minus four on attack, if we had not done that, the reality is those tackles would have done like significantly more damage. I'm talking a lot more, so very, very good. Uh, I do think what we will do next episode, I don't think we're going to train up. We're not going to train in between episodes. We're going to keep everything the way it is because I do think we're at a decent uh, spot at this point. We're going to make our way through Viridian Forest, get, our, get ourselves over to Pewter City. We don't get any more encounters before fighting Brock. Uh, so we do have some work ahead of us to get ready for that gym battle, but hopefully Viridian Forest is going to prepare us for it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, really do appreciate it, and I cannot wait to see you in Episode 3 of our Pokemon Fire Red Nuzlocke. I'll talk to you guys then.